going to Overworld. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure we're going to Overworld. Okay, oh, we're going to Overworld. <clears throat> oh, there's my parachute. My red, red parachute. I'll paint my jetpack. Is that going to goof it? Uh, no, it shouldn't. Although you can't use it until you land. I thought maybe oh. you could, like, you know, you could hit shift yeah, to get out funny. of it and then, uh, you know, like, fly off. But no, you can't do that. Splash down. Yeah, it doesn't work nearly as well. <laughs> Darn that gravity. Yes. It was too bad. I put all that effort into doing that silly little railway. And I think we only used it like once. <laughs> I used it a bunch of times, actually. Yeah, but the, the, the hang glider is so much better than that. Well, this is true. Okay, so... Uh, by the way, you asked before about whether the elevators were broken. I checked all the elevators. I could not find any any problem. Uh, really? Because yeah. it was not working for me at all. Not working at all, or? Well, you try. It. I just went up. Yeah, go down. I just went down. I met the fuel supply maintenance access door. It's not working. Now for I'm going to come up, and there I am. Not see. Hmm. Jump up, okay, down, and it won't go down anymore. Uh. I don't know what to say. I just did it. I mean, what? See? Ooh, it's not working up for me either. I just went down. I, you can see that I'm underneath, right? I mean, yep. Well, you can see I'm I'm jumping up. Nothing. Yeah, maybe my jetpack's goofing. Let me try to take my jetpack off. Okay. All right. So where do we want to? Where do we, we want to mm -hmm. this? <laughs> something. Something has used up all the power. Really? Did you leave the TV on? Uh, no, but I'm wondering. I'm wondering if I. I'm wondering if I left on. Um, there are there are some older machines that tend to use power even when they're not doing anything. Mm-hmm. I think we took all the hydrogen tanks to, to, to Mars. Oh, doors work, my goodness. <laughs> Hi, Chow. Try not to kill me this time. Well, you'll have to try not to hit him. Well, it was an accident. He's just not very forgiving. All right, so I'm going to put it down here uh, in the oxygen collection area because that's the biggest uh, open area <clears throat> we've got. <clears throat> okay. And now I think if I put paper in my hand from the other teleporter and right-click this breaks it. <clears throat> Which is... It's a feature. Hmm. Maybe I have to left click. Yeah, if I just... If I left click, it does nothing. If I right click, it breaks it. I should probably take off my O2 stuff since I don't need it. Um. Yeah, but as far as I know, there's no there's no drawback to having it on. Well, other than using oxygen all the time. Oh, okay. Whoa! What happened? Um. Yeah, you just broke the universe. I now have these two options. It says Mars base and current location, and an X in the middle. Choose current location. Uh, current location. Okay. Why should that? That's weird. Why are you saying? Hmm. 
So I don't know this, whatever you did. Is but, this going to make everybody teleport? Uh, apparently. I'm hitting current location. Hit nothing. Mars base. Click Mars base. Oh, but I'm not wearing my oxygen. Oh, nope, cool. nothing. Nope, nothing I click seems to do anything, and I'm hearing wind noise. Put your, put, oh, put, put your gear back on, first of all. I, I can't do anything. Oh, wait. Hold on, I escaped. Wow, that was weird. How did I get down here? I I don't know. I assume that I see. You know, this this may not be compatible with multiplayer. I thought it was. Ooh, wow! You're getting all purpley. Hmm. When you step on it, it sucks in all the stars. Oh yeah, and it changes me. Wow! Every time you do it, it seems to affect my player. Well, that's what I'm saying. I think maybe we both have to go. I'm clicking Mars base, but it isn't doing anything. No, I'm trying to escape out of it, and I can only escape out of it for like a second. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Here, well, here, let me put my... If you're going to beam me up, Scotty, I want to put on my face mask and my O2 stuff again. I don't think this is going to work, though. I have a feeling it may not. Is there another form of uh, transportation? Uh, um, Star, Stargate, maybe? Oh, uh -oh. Star Stargate <laughs> can't go... There is a Stargate mod, but it can't go to negative dimensions, and the galactic um, dimensions are negative. Yeah, that's that's okay. That's the, that's the water for the hydrogen generator upstairs. Yeah, but it's leaking. No, it's not. Well, what's that? It's coming through the roof. Minecraft just has a thing where, to show you that water is above, it produces drips on the one block area below, so that you know, like, when you're digging around somewhere, that there's, like, water or oil or lava directly above you. Wow, that's gonna stain. That's really gonna bring down the resale value. Here, what if I click on it? Or do you walk on it? Oh, okay. Are you walking? Uh, Alright, I just I just click, click the document and it says this. Uh, teleporting. Stand on pad and wait three to five seconds. Oh. Uh, allowing friends oh. to use pad. Right click telepad while empty handed. It says damn I forgot my telepad register. Ah, oh, okay. So the person traveling needs the document. That's what it is. Yeah, the document is what allows you to go. Okay, so do you have the document? Yeah. Okay, well, give it to me. Um, okay. But the instructions are on it, and I haven't finished reading. Oh. Uh, it says to allow a. Uh, it says to allow another player to use it. You uh, left click with an open hand. Doesn't seem to do anything. But then again, I don't yeah, have the document. Allowing friends to use pad. Right click telepad empty handed. B let whoop. Oh, it oh says as it, the owner of this pad, it looks like you have lost, lost your register. register. Would you register. like a new one? I'd like a new register, please. No thanks, I only forgot it. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I click on either of them and nothing happened. Oops, it says, oops, this is not my telepad. I have a feeling that this is a very single-player yeah. oriented thing. Well, I I have a feeling they have owners, like the lasers, and so I have to make yes. it so that you can use that. So g give me the register back, and let me let me finish reading the instructions. Let's see if there's anything useful. Okay, if you've lost your register, stand on one of your pads to recover one. Telepads, what, remember what location you traveled to last. Telepads are player only and can be shared can be shared with anyone if set to universal access. Step three, universal pads can't be removed. All right, so the, we have to make this pad universal. Um, right click telepad while empty handed. And let the friend right click his register on the telepad. All right, take that and then right-click on the telepad. Empty hand or holding no, the thing? No, with the, with the register. Okay, I'm right-clicking. And I think no, no, just stand just on one, it. Right just click. once. Now stand on it and try to choose a destination. It says, oops, this is not my telepad. Correct. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to have to go to Google for this one, I think. Mm -hmm. it, it looks like there should be a way to set it to universal 
for all players. We have to figure out what right. that is. Though it wasn't working for me either. Uh, or maybe maybe I just didn't wait long enough? Give me, give me, give me back the register. It's probably like a portal, you know, you have to stand in it. Okay. Oh. Okay, now, now there's no registration. F oh. Oh. What? See, for me, for me, the world goes all goofy, and it says current location. Okay, I'm and... outside the base, and I'm being surrounded by zombies. Whoa, how'd that happen? I have no idea. Whoa, okay. So you're gone, gone. Well, no, I'm just, I mean, it, it teleported me just outside the base. Now, somehow I created a register that's linked to this teleporter and lost the one that was linked to the, to the Mars teleporter. Oops. Okay, you sneak right click to set a teleporter to universal. Telepad plane set to universal access. Okay. Right, so Do you have to sneak right click open hand? Oh wow, I have all these registers now. Um how many Weird. One, two, three, four. You probably gave me you know what you probably just gave me back the wrong one. Uh give give, give, oh, give, them, give them all. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on a second. It says register telepad locations. One of the documents says uh, 776, and then it has a series of Y coordinates, but the, oh, okay, here's one that says Mars base dim negative 29, and then a bunch of other series of XY yeah. coordinates, and yeah. then planes dim zero. Yeah, give me that. But give now me the I Mars have one. these, yeah, I have three other ones that I believe are listed to this location. It says planes dim zero, but it doesn't say a dimension or anything. And dim zero with a bunch of XY coordinates. Yeah. So, so it give made... Me, give me the Mars one. Okay. Here, hold on a second. This appears to be the Mars one. See, they're all green, so they all look exactly the same. So yeah. until you highlight them, you can't tell which is which. Okay, now I can click on Mars Base, and when I do that, nothing happens whatsoever. Well, I get a box that says, as the owner of this pad, it looks like you lost your register, would you like a new one? And I should say, no thanks, I only forgot it. Because every time you do something, it seems to also affect me. Alright, what, what, tell you what, why don't you log out and I'll try to use this. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, I'm out. I think my presence, for whatever functionality this thing has, is seems to be disrupted by my presence. Nope, that doesn't appear to be it, because choosing Mars base just throws me over two blocks. <laughs> You're only supposed to have one register in your in your inventory at a time. I think that's... Oh. That doesn't make sense, though. Yeah. Alright, let me put this... Let me put this other one... Dimension zero. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. You know what it is? The register. The register is not per location. The register is all your locations. So this one has Mars and this one. I think I was probably confusing it by having both of them in my inventory at once. Probably. And, and one of them only had this location. I had like three. Okay, so now. So should I get mine out of my inventory? Mars base. base. I keep clicking Mars base and getting nothing. See, I think my... See, our, our characters seem to be connected with this, and I think me not being there is part of the problem, but I also think me having these registers here also is part of the problem. So... Well, tell you what. I'll tell you what, then. Let's, let's go up and throw all the other registers into the trash. Yes. <laughs> so, go up there. I'm not sure how any of this works. <laughs> okay, so that one I'm going to keep. Oh, you know what though? Uh-oh. Yeah, see this 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 register doesn't work either because uh, there's one that lists the telepad location um, 
as being a universal pad. Mm-hmm. But the one the that other one has the, yeah, the one that has the Mars thing on it does not. All right, you See, know that's what? what I think I think okay. that has to be sent to Universal first. Okay, so I I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to ditch all of these, and I'm going to go into creative mode and destroy this thing. Destroy it before it destroys us. By the way, you're not in creative mode, are you? I have no idea. I didn't know that you could change modes. What's a key command for uh, changing it back? It's not. It's a terminal. Thing. Yeah. Well, that's what I mean. It's forward slash game mode yep. space S to put you into survival. Okay. You said it's a survival mode, so that should be for both of us. No, it's per it's per player. Oh, it is. Okay. I believe so. Uh, okay, and so I'm gonna make another pair of these things. Yeah, I have game mode zero, which is survival, right? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Iron block of iron. Redstone, redstone, redstone. Ender, well, and glass. And it gives me two. So, first one down here. Oh, by the way, we, we left our rockets back in the, uh, in the lake. <laughs> yes, we did. So we got to go back out there. Hopefully they won't rust. Okay, we'll, we'll base. Okay, and now I have a new register and a new telepad. And I'm going to sneak click on this. Okay, overworld base set to universal access. And I look at my register and it says universal pad dimension zero. Okay, so now... We have to go to Mars again? Yeah, well actually if you want you can stay here and I will go. Okay. To drop off. Oh yeah, the uh, I gotta install the cargo rocket schematic. Okay, so cargo rocket schematic unlocked. Okay, um, let's see. Yeah, okay, fueled. I'm launching. I get in the bathroom, I'll be right back. Okay. Okay, Siller. 
Yeah, uh, this thing almost killed me. Oh, jeez. Um. It's, what happened? You still on Mars? Yeah, I'm on Mars. I, I laid down the new... I laid down the new pad, I made it mm -hmm. universal, and it updated my register. But now my register shows two locations, both just called Universal Pad, in the same dimension, with different... Uh, coordinates. Basically what it did is it teleported me to the coordinates of the Earth telepad, but in the Mars dimension, which happened to be inside solid rock. Wow. Okay. So... Ugh. Are you sure these things are interdimensional? Yeah, it says they're supposed to be, but maybe they don't work. Maybe they're broken the same way this Stargate thing is broken with that they don't work with negative dimensions. Hmm. Okay, well, I think we're going to have to wrap it up for today. Yeah, I think so. Uh, these, so thing, these things obviously don't work, at least not the way they are. Maybe if there's a way to hack the register. Um, I don't know. That's weird. I don't know either. Okay, so tell you what. Can you go change your settings now? Yep, yep, I'm going to do it. All right, okay. so, so uh, see you guys next time. We'll try to fix these teleporters. <laughs> Goodbye.